The Georgia Bulldogs earned some bragging rights after the latest edition of Clean Old Fashioned Hate. And Marvin James has a look at the big showdown over the weekend. The tension between the red and black and gold and white was showcased for 60 minutes between the hedges last Saturday. Mary Persons graduate Malik Herring enjoyed his first college start last weekend and says the focus to get better remained the same while not overlooking the Yellow Jackets, but taking things one game at a time. I think we improved every week. Mindset, mindset, and everybody doing their job, not just trying not to be heroes. I, I don't really think we can build on this game going into next week because it's a different kind of offense. The Dogs pretty much dominated on offense and defense in the regular season ender, but gave up a few big mistakes on special teams. But overall, quarterback Jake Fromm and fellow backfield mate Elijah Holyfield say there's no time to be satisfied with the status quo. Tyler Simmons has definitely gotten better. Um, you know, Trey Hill's growing up. He's done a great job for us at right guard. Um, James Cook, man, we call him the mongoose. It's just, just slippery uh, when he goes into the game. Um, you know, I mean, obviously, you know, Riley's doing what he's doing. Miko's doing what he's doing. Terry's doing what he's doing. The offensive line's doing what they're doing. You know, guys said, hey, you know, we're going to come together. And it's, it's just kind of a, a, a kind of a keep chopping thing. And just something we kind of did after that bye week. We're, we're doing pretty well, you know, and we're continually getting better. You know, and, uh, as long as we continue to get better, we'll be fine. We're still not at our, we're still not at our potential yet. We don't feel like we still feel like we have other places that we can bring this offense. So uh, I'm sure we will. Now the regular season is in the past and the week ahead is all about a rematch with their national championship opponent in the Crimson Tide. Nothing left to say, but it's go time. I mean, most definitely. Alabama, going, they one of the best one of the best teams in the country, so we just got to have a great week of practice and get a great look from the scout team. I think we'll be all right. Marvin James, 13 WMAZ, Sports. Now tonight, the college football playoffs will release its latest rankings, which expect to see Georgia back in the top four. We're going to update you tonight at 11.